Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, I'll explain how to add a Yahoo email account to Gmail, so you can check and review all your emails in a single inbox. Let's get straight into it. If you have a Yahoo email account, Gmail provides an easy way for you to see any new emails you receive in Yahoo in your existing Gmail account. In this Woggle Guide, we're going to look at how to add a Yahoo email account to your Gmail account. We'll do this in three separate sections of this guide. Firstly, we'll look at the methods you can use to link a Yahoo account to Gmail. Then I'll explain how to use the most common quick linking method known as Gmailify. And lastly, we'll look at how to identify and highlight those emails from Yahoo within your Gmail inbox with a special label. I'm logged into Google and I'm in my Gmail inbox. To add another email account to Gmail, I need to click into the settings section of Gmail. I can do this by moving my mouse to the top right of the inbox. You'll see there are a number of icons in this area, but the one I'm interested in is the gear or cog icon. Let's click on that. This opens up the Gmail quick settings, which allows you to make some of the more common settings changes. However, I want to go into the details settings section of Gmail. So I'll click on the option button that says see all settings. This opens up a new page that has a number of heading tabs. We're interested in the account and import section, however, so I'll click into that. On this page, I'm going to move down the page a little to the area called check mail from other accounts. By adding a Yahoo email address in this section, this will allow us to import both old and new emails from your Yahoo email account, so they can be viewed alongside your Gmail account. To start the steps to add your Yahoo email address, click on the link that says add a mail account. A new window then opens that asks you to enter the email address for your Yahoo email account. Let's quickly enter that now and to continue I'll click on the next button. Gmail offers you two ways to link your Yahoo account with Gmail. You can use a quick setup process called Gmailify or you can manually configure and import the emails. For the rest of this guide, I'll explain how to link your Yahoo account to Gmail using the Gmailify process. But if you're interested in the alternative linking method, check out the Woggle guide shown above. So what does Gmailify actually mean? Well, it means that when you associate your Yahoo account with your Gmail account, it will benefit from all the great features offered by Gmail. So things like the advanced spam filters or the Gmail inbox prioritization and sorting features will then be applied to your Yahoo account. The Gmailify option is already chosen, so I'll click on the next button to continue. So because we entered my Yahoo email address at the start of this process, the next page takes me to a Yahoo login page. You'll see that the email address I entered is already shown. I'll click on the next button to continue. Let's now enter the password for the Yahoo email account, and again, I'll click on the next button to proceed. On the next page, Yahoo asks you to confirm that you allow Gmail access to your Yahoo account. Specifically, you are confirming that Gmail can see your profile information such as name and email address, as well as allowing Gmail to read, write and send emails for your Yahoo account. You need to agree to this to allow Gmail to see and respond to any Yahoo emails you receive in your inbox. If you're happy to proceed, click the Agree button. Once you do that, it can take a little time to complete the integration. But once done, Gmail then confirms that your Yahoo account has been Gmailified. Click on the Close button to show your settings page. On the settings page, in the Accounts and Import section, you'll now find that the Yahoo account has been added. Emails sent to your Yahoo account will automatically also appear in your Gmail inbox. If we go into your Gmail inbox, you'll see an email has arrived from the Yahoo email team, confirming that Gmail now has access to your Yahoo account. You'll notice, however, that this email doesn't look any different from the other emails sent to your Gmail account. If I click into it, and I'll then click on the small drop-down arrow next to the email address at the top of the email, you can confirm that this email was actually sent to the Yahoo address originally. I'll now show you an easy way to highlight those emails which have come from Yahoo. In order to do that, I'm going to start by highlighting the Yahoo email address I use. And then if I right-click on that, I'll choose to copy the email address. If you can type your Yahoo email address from memory, there's no need to do this step. I now want to go into the search filter in Gmail. 
I can do that by clicking on the search options icon next to the Gmail search bar. If you want to learn more about how to use filters in Gmail, see the Woggle guide linked in the description below and shown above. However, I will continue to go through the basics of what you need to know now in this guide. We're interested in the two row on this page. This asks Gmail to specifically search for emails sent to a specific email address that arrive in your Gmail inbox. We want to find emails that were sent to our Yahoo account, so I'm going to click in that two row and I'll paste the Yahoo email address I've just copied by right clicking on it and choosing the paste option. You can also type this email address directly into the two box if you remember it. That's all we need to add into this window. So I'll move to the bottom of this box and click on the Create Filter button to move on. In this next window, Gmail asks what you want to do with the email sent to your Yahoo email address. Looking at the options, we definitely don't want to skip the inbox as we want to see the email arrive. So I'm going to choose the Apply the Label option and select the checkbox next to it. If you're not familiar with labels, this is a way to identify different emails in Gmail. Once I've done that, if I click on the drop down arrow next to choose label, I now want to create a new label to describe these emails. So let's choose that option. A box then appears that asks you to give the new label a name. I'll call this label Yahoo and I'll click on the large blue create button to confirm that. Gmail then confirms that the Yahoo label has been created and you'll see it's now the chosen label on this page. To ensure that this label is applied to all the existing email messages sent to Yahoo that are in your inbox, be sure to click the checkbox next to the option that says also apply filter to matching conversations. And to confirm our label setup, I'll click on the large blue create filter button. You'll see that the Yahoo label has been added to all those messages sent to my Gmail account. And as you receive any new emails to your Yahoo email address, they will automatically appear in your Gmail inbox and have the Yahoo label added to each of them. I hope you found this Woggle guide useful and learned something new. If you have, please like or subscribe for free so that you can see other great guides. Thanks for watching.